waking up in the morning, thinking about so many things. Tell you how I'm doing. Not well, bitch. Pass the holy whore. Jealous of what? Your ugly leather pants? Should I bow to you? Okay. Hello, Beverly Tube. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills. And guys, I am back in LA. I finally watched the last episode of The Real House of Beverly Hills. And it is time to talk because there is a lot going on here. Most of it related to the Erica Jane show, you know? And I was like, we, we, we just need to discuss this, okay? Because for the past two days, if you have been watching, you know I was in San Francisco, I was doing like another things, and I couldn't really dive deep into a bunch of things, but now I'm back and I'm like, damn, there is so much tea happening. Like you cannot, you know, go away, spend a couple days having a little vacation because bitch, that is always something going on with the Erica Jane show, right? Anyways, before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now. If you are new here and you want to join the Beverly Troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. And let's talk about this mess. And let's start with Miss Lisa Rena. Okay. By now, you probably know that there is a whole thing going on with Erica and Garcelle and the producers. And like... A whole thing so I'm gonna be doing I will say several videos you know between today and tomorrow that you cannot miss where we're gonna be discussing all of these situations so let's start with Lisa Rena basically kind of like throwing Erica Jane under the bus on her Instagram you know um, and then Erica kind of like responding on her own way um, Lisa Rena went to the to her Instagram after the episode air on Wednesday, right? And basically post, dang it, I wish they had shown the screaming fight between the producers and Erica last night on the show in La Quinta. Now, now that would have been epic TV. Too bad. Bravo, bravo, fucking bravo. I'll get in trouble for this in five four three two one a smiley face a smiley face a smiley face whatever you know okay i i'm still trying trying to understand the real position of lisa rena on this okay because initially it was said that you know lisa rena was one of erica jane's closest friends you know, that she has been there through everything, holding her hand, being like, I love you, girl. You know, we're doing this together. You know, there are reports that allegedly Erica Jane, like, um, put some money on Lisa Rena businesses, you know, and they're together. I mean, and, and you know, they're super, these super close friends. But since the show has been airing, it has been kind of showing us a different side. You know what I mean? Like, if you really think about it, what Lisa Rena has been saying on the show is not the face of someone who is actually your best friend and has your best interest, which I'm not surprised. I mean, you know Lisa Rena. Lisa Rena is just... She's just going to throw under the bus whoever she needs to in order to get her storyline, you know. And also, I think that she's not going to, that the reality is that she's not going to get too involved, especially until we know if she is, if Erica Jane is innocent or not. Right? So, I think that Lisa Rena, I mean, she has always been on, on these episodes being very like, like, 
I don't know. I don't know what is happening. Oh my God, is this true? But that's not the attitude of someone's BFF. You know, like if she was really Erica's BFF, she will be more like, no, she's innocent. I know she's innocent. She's going to prove everyone wrong. You know, we're here together. We're going to fight this thing. You know, everyone is just a hater. But that's not Lisa Renna's position. You know, she has always been very like, hmm. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I hear stuff. I don't know. You know, kind of like throwing little, like pushing her in a slow motion under the bus, basically. You know what I mean? Like, boop. You know what I mean? So, and I'm surprised. Of course, I'm not surprised. So, this is just another part of it. Like, okay, there is this huge feud also between Erica Jane and the producers, which I'm going to be talking about in another video. But why is up to you to expose this to the fans, right? It's clear that Erica didn't want this out there. Otherwise, she wouldn't have posted herself, right? So, and if it wasn't because of this post of Lisa Rena, people wouldn't have gone into the black hole of what is coming next that we're going to be talking next, right? So, um, I don't know. I mean... I don't know what 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 why is she behind it. Oh my! I know why she's. But it's just weird. I don't know. It's like how far is she willing to go just to be relevant? Because I think this is the whole point of Lisa Rena. He's just she just wants to be relevant, right? Now, of course, we're here for it because we are here for the drama. You know, it's just like th I'm thinking in like trying to see from the point of like girl i mean this is supposed to be your your friend and you clearly doesn't give a fuck so i'm hoping that the other ladies are thinking the same people like kyle richards are thinking shit if she's doing this to someone that she's close to very close like erica jane i definitely cannot trust this bitch you know what i mean um now erica jane eventually goes on and repost what she posts, basically kind of like acknowledging the fact and saying like, yes, this is true. I had a huge fallout, a huge fight with the producers over this. Again, we're going to talk about what happened in another video because this is just about Lisa Red. So, I don't know. What do you guys think about this? Where do you think, are you surprised by Lisa Rena doing these kind of shady things, you know, um, do you think that she, that this it's gonna end up anywhere? I don't look honestly. I don't even think that Lisa Rena has actual friends. It's kind of weird, but you see, you see, as someone like Kyle Richards, she look at Kyle Richards with Chris Jenner and Faye Resnick. You know, uh, like, sh they are friends, you know? They are, like, literally, like, friends, friends. You know, that, that you can feel the, the friendship right there. But Lisa Rena, I feel that she hasn't had that ever, probably. And that's why she is so jealous of really good friendships. That's why she probably went ahead and do everything on her power to destroy Lisa Vanderpump and Carl Richards' friendship because she doesn't understand the concept of being an actual real friend. So, and I don't think, I mean, that's going to be very hard to, at this point, I mean, she is so she's older right now i don't think she's gonna change her ways um i think that it is what it is but i don't know i mean that's me let me know what you think in the comments below uh do you think it was right from lisa rena to throw erica under the bus you know given the circumstances and like always don't forget to like this video share this video subscribe to my youtube channel guys and i'll see you around see ya bye